here with the Limerick Junior Manager, Graham Shine. Graham, disappointing result to lose by six points to down. I suppose initial thoughts after that result? Um, we're happy enough for the first half. Um, I thought we played well, you know, against the breeze and stuff. I thought we carried the ball very well. Um, we came in at half time, everything was perfect, and for some reason the third quarter we were really flat. Um, they got the goal in, uh, looking at, uh, probably a goal that shouldn't have gone in at the near post, you know. Uh, then we got a yellow card, and um, they got on top of us. We were chasing the game, look, they're probably better than us in the, a lot better than us in the second half. But um, look, we are disappointed, but we, look, we have two weeks now to, to fix things and be ready for Fermanagh in the semi final. Look at that performance. It was fairly nip and tuck in the first half between the two of you. You get the goal and come straight back into the lead of it. You're a point down at half time. I suppose the second half, where do you think the game was, was won and lost, I suppose, from your point of view? Yeah, I just think they came out the blocks quicker than us, you know, and uh, we had a couple of attacks there and there was a bad turnovers for us and they, count, they transitioned it really quick and I think that goal was a right sucker punch for us. It was a free kick, if I can remember. Went into near post, but shouldn't have gone in and as uh, Grace got the yellow card in as well and you're down to 14 against a good strong team and you are just chasing the game and we could never, we had chances. Irish kicked a nice few points there and I thought we were going to come back into it and uh, look, it just time runs out from your chase and you know, and that's football, isn't it? I suppose thoughts on refereeing decisions as well. I know a few, you and a few of the lads on the sideline were getting a bit animated at, at times. Does that really have a big impact in today's game? I won't say that it gave a big impact, but it's consistency, you know. Um, there was freeze given for some, some things and there was freeze, uh, freeze that weren't given and I thought we weren't allowed to use the advantage as much as, uh, as down were but look, they, that didn't cause us to lose the game obviously but as I say we just like a bit of consistency and we know what's, what, what's, what's right you know but uh, look as I say we have two weeks now to prepare for the Fermanagh game. Yeah you mentioned Fermanagh there in a, in a two week break. This is yourselves and Fermanagh and yet another All-Ireland semi-final shades of last year again where, where they knocked you out that final stage. Is that going to be dwelling on the players' minds, taking on a Fermanagh team? I know Down did beat them in the Ulster final and you give Down a right battle today, but I suppose is it, is it a new game plan the next day that it doesn't matter about previous results against Fermanagh? Yeah, it's 100%. It's a brand new game. It's a different year, different season. So a different bunch of girls in the dressing room too. Um, we have a big change of squad this year. So I look for Fermanagh are a great team. They have some great players. Uh, we played them last year in the, in the league, final, in league semi-final. We beat them. And then we met them in the other in the semi final and they beat us. So it's going to be a very close game, very exciting game. There'll be nothing in it. And uh, hopefully we'll come out on top and, uh, on the day.